The following demonstration will show commercial fishers how to submit a nil return using Fisher Mobile. On the home screen, tap on the other reports icon. Then select the nil return menu option. Tap on the fishing business number field and select the fishing business number for the nil return. If only one fishing business is owned, then this field will auto populate with the fishing business number. Then tap on the year field and select the year to which the nil return relates. The 12 months for the selected year will load. To select the month or months you wish to submit the nil report for, tap on the box next to the required month. The selected months will be indicated by a tick. Only months where a report has not been submitted will be available to select. Where a report has previously been submitted, a notation will be seen next to that month. To deselect a month, simply tap on the box to remove the tick. Review the month or months you have ticked and ensure they are correct. Then tap on the Submit button. A confirmation message will be displayed. Read this confirmation message prior to tapping on the Confirm button. You will receive a successfully submitted message for your nil return. Tap on the OK button to return to the home screen. Note that if a nil return is submitted in advance but phishing occurs, then a catch and effort report is required to be submitted. For more video demonstrations on the functions and use of Fisher Mobile, visit the Fish Online webpage.